Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, I hope everybody's having as good day as possible. Um, today in the Midlands, it's uh, now brightened up, and it's been so it's sunny today. Um, but um, we've also had a lot of rain uh, today. Um, so uh, today I'm going to be doing a, a video on Travel News Worldwide 10 Exciting Facts Worldwide Part 1 at uh, June 2021 and uh, just before we jump right into it could you please subscribe to my channel it, it's free to subscribe I upload five times a week on both my lifestyle and travel channel also don't forget you can join my memberships for just 99 pence per month and uh, you can get extra perks uh, from my travel channel and um, so i'm going to jump into the video uh, now and as always the information is from breakingtravelnews.com uh, which is a brilliant website that uh, you can go and visit to find more information about uh, these stories but um, I'm going to give you the lowdowns and um, number one is um, which is first up intercontinental rider um, in Saudi Arabia, King Fahid rode to debut in 2025, that's the latest hotel news in Saudi Arabia. The property forms part of, of a master development agreement with um, Reviver Development Company um, it's um, wholly owned subsidy weaver hospitality for hotel services at company wow that it looks it sounds amazing number two um fred olsen uh, cruises returns to operation with um Bora lee's debut wow that's again the latest cruise news and um, fred olsen cruise lines has uh, resumed sailing yes with uh, the new borrelis your list deport uh, departing on uh, her maiden voyage from liverpool uk wow uh, she uh, will sail a number of uh, trips around the uk this summer wow that's really interesting i hope it goes as well as possible and um third um is virgin atlantic leads uh, reopening of ethero ethero airport as confirmed it will return to two runway operation uh, from this week ahead of a predicted optic in travel the busiest airport in the uk will also reopen terminal three later this month wow that is amazing i went to uh, from terminal at three to new york and it was just an amazing experience wow um i hope it goes as well as possible number four malta to require paper COVID-19 vaccine certificate again before you can enter the co uh, country and number five Norwegian Airlines takes its first modest steps towards recovery I hope it goes as well as possible for Norwegian Airlines um, number six UK hospitality welcomes England reopening plans again yay that's a uh, hopefully going to be fantastic um and um number seven emirates first class lounge at dubai international airport um is going to be um opening and uh, number eight um 
SC Seaview returns operation in Germany. That's um, another bit of good news from the cruise uh, services around the world. And um, number nine, celebrity Flora returns to Galapagos um, Islands. Um, again, that's another international cruise news and um, latest and last but not least beast beach check explains to new locations across the uk so what um good luck to the locations across the uk and beach check um company for that i hope it goes as well as possible this summer especially so uh, tomorrow I'm going to be doing um, a travel news uh, five fantastic brand new travel UK facts. So um, I hope everybody has as good day and as night as possible and I hope everybody is well and um, or as well as possible just say and Thank you and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.